all of this, knowing and just being with yourself, all of this just happens. All of this, all of this just happens here. So if I'm if I'm gonna be with a to keep it simple, be with a female uh, companion, that'll just happen. Um, there, uh, and I think it's one of the <clears throat> things that could that will that will save so much agony um, as far as relationships go. There, the is to find one's find oneself capital S there find oneself and there and just keep giving yourself time to just go beyond thought and be with yourself there the more uh, we do that <clears throat> the much more loving life we will experience and know and and uh and the the relationships had when when others when more and more people are doing that uh here old um and be something we generally don't uh, experience on the planet <laughs> at this time <laughs> here. <clears throat> so I uh, I'm going to do another video update here, maybe right after this one, because I didn't get into some uh, stuff about daily things. Uh, here and, and stuff and and that's okay here it's a um, um, if you you know if you like to uh, there's there's two two men um, I'll give you I'll give you four of the uh, of my guru buddies <laughs> four of my guru buddies uh, there I've got 20 plus just over 20 years of practicing Kriya Yoga as taught by Paramahansa Yogananda there and uh, that's part of what I went to India is for like the next step with that and I got initiated again by another um, guru in the same lineage uh, there and worked with with him some and stuff but um and uh, for this I'm not for this going beyond thought I'm not not pointing to Yogananda um, about this because he's got another uh, his path is another way of helping you get uh, to that uh, at some point there has obviously happened for me uh, there but um, and then two others that will help uh, a tremendous amount with a with a with a picking up a piece of plastic uh, with uh, a very uh, a, a really deep experience a heart a, Hard, expanding, mind-blowing experience of uh, love, and that would be uh, Ram Das's guru, which is Neem Karali Baba. Neem Karali Baba, big fat guy, big fat, happy, joyful, playful <laughs> guy that just exudes uh, an endless, endless waves of love. Uh, there and and then the other one uh, who Neem was real real close with too uh, and she with him too is uh, 
<clears throat> someone a, a little m more well known uh, here in the in the states anyway would be uh, Sri Ananda Mema. There, so and there's some books about them and stuff, and there's things on YouTube too, and uh, there's Facebook groups and stuff. But uh, the two main um, men uh, teach directly. Well, Ramana Maharishi, uh, I understand he didn't, you know, in, unless you asked directly or or got to the point or something, but he generally didn't teach uh, publicly uh, about is what I read uh, about, um, you know, um, one of the ways of putting that is awareness, watching awareness or awareness, observing awareness or um, other words could be self-observing self. Self-observing self, self. So Ramana Maharishi, and I, uh, there, I think he, uh, a book, uh, Who Am I? You know, and there's some others. I'd, I'd point to uh, uh, Maru Ganar. Am I saying that right? Maru Ganar. One of his, one of his closest devotees is very poetic there uh, and, and helps helps uh, through his writing and expressing and sharing about his experience of self there um, you'll you'll recognize uh, you'll recognize having had and having those experiences too uh, there because it, it's, it's our natural the world of thought is unnatural um, to us, especially when you're lost in it, uh, there, it's really uh, just a total expression of love. I mean, look at this. Um, Muganar. Um, so Ramana, Maharishi, and then a, a less known, although there was. Many people that came to see him in his apartment in uh, oh, his Mumbai now um, there, and he he had several outlets for selling uh, cigarettes. That's how he supported his family uh, there. So that kind of you know, and married and kids and stuff. It starts it starts to dissolve our concept of. Uh, to be a yogi or a guru, you have to do it like this. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> there and uh, but Nazar Gadada, Nazar Gadada. There, particularly uh, the last two books. Um, uh, about him, uh, there. Uh, I'll walk over here. Of the uh, all the books I've had. All the books I had in India. Uh, I kept, uh, I think, uh, three, and these are two of them. So this is Nazar Gadada. You can see his name there. So this is Beyond Freedom. And then this one is Consciousness and the Absolute. Consciousness and the Absolute uh, by uh, 
his uh, closest devotee, uh, Jean Dunn, there. So, uh, to, to help with uh, finding your way <laughs> beyond thought so you can know yourself, uh, those are the two main books I would point to there. So, um, this this is this is the core of the yogi van life here this is the core of the yogi van life here is um, uh, going beyond thought there and then you're not you know you you lose you lose consciousness of thinking about how you live your life and you find your life just happening in, in ways ways you just never never would have could have uh, imagined and uh, the experiences I have out here uh, the, the loneliness is is a, about that much of it there but just the overwhelming beauty overwhelming beauty And as a, I'm, you may have noticed, I'm starting to say, instead of have too much fun, although I do still say that, some words I learned from a new friend. They met at Franklin Hot Springs. His name is Morty. And he says, lots of love, lots of love.